Hi, this is TapCat. Welcome back to XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. I don't know if this is going to be a standard VIP extraction or if there's something special about it. Obviously, it's kind of being presented in a little bit different way. I did go ahead and put together a squad, so we're going to have uh, Riggs and Murtaugh back together again, and then Danko and Ridzik. So we'll have two pair of bonded soldiers. That should be interesting. And then I'm going to bring a rookie along. And uh, that's it. This will be our first mission with five squad members. I am actually pretty happy about that. We're being asked to assist in a rescue operation for a resistance VIP currently trapped by Advent in the tunnels beneath the city center. I'm not sure what our target was up to, but the resistance needs us to get him out of there. Hostile activity in the area is very likely, so keep your heads up. The Resistance VIP is hiding in the tunnels not far from your position. One of their field operatives is also on site to assist you in the rescue. Firebrand is standing by, but be careful. We'll have limited opportunities to set up a viable extraction point down there. Well, I guess that answers my question. This is very much not standard. I love... Uh, well, I can't really zoom in on it, but I love seeing our little posters out here. In the world... Okay, so, whoa, they're not close. Okay. Do I want to walk through the middle? I don't know if I do. On my way. Riggs, you don't see nothing. I will go. Move Danko up here, see if he sees anything. Nope. There's no time limit. I don't know if I trust that. I'm going to go ahead and move up a little bit. Okay. And then I'll come in like right behind him. Got it. Moving. Uh, you can Heading come out. here. And rookie. You go here. Target location. You can go on Overwatch because nothing beats rookie Overwatch. Overwatch. <laughs> to Overwatch. All right. Uh, Commander, remember, no matter how tough things get down here, we can't evac until we complete the mission. Wow. Basically, he just told us we're expendable. <laughs> That's what I heard. I can't say I much care for that either. Oh, I went to the wrong spot. I couldn't see. Oh, uh, that's annoying. Well, I got to be honest. I don't think I uh, I dare move forward anymore with him because if I reveal somebody on a dash, woo, that would be bad. So I kind of have the same issue with him, but I think it's less likely because they were off in that direction. Yeah, I'm gonna leave him where he's at, and I think what I'll do, I'll bring him here. That's actually where I'm. Should have brought him. It's fine. On Overwatch. Okay, rookie. Um, you just come in behind come him. In. And Ridzik, you can come here. Roger that. And we will Overwatch. So we still hear something. Are we going to see something? Sounds like an advent troop, but... Okay. Well, I'm gonna keep moving forward. Got some hostiles grouped over here. That can't be what I was hearing. Are you kidding me? It was supposed to be in this direction. I guess they could have moved. <sighs> They're kind of far. I wonder if it's even possible that we could just keep moving without fighting them, but. Uh, oh boy. Let me bring him here. They're so far. It's kind of crazy. Well, there's my VIP. 
I kind of want to go through the door, man. <laughs> Let's see what happens. I need to know if these guys are going to come toward us, away from us, or what. I can get there. So I'm probably going to move Murtaugh. Actually, maybe I'll move him here. Let's get behind full cover. There's no point standing out here like an idiot. This is kind of interesting, isn't it? All right, I'll do that. Put my sniper on a perch. You know who needs the perch? Oh, he has cover, doesn't he? Yes. But it doesn't look like she would have it if I moved her there. All right. What if I move her here with the idea that we would come up? Let's do this. Because, I mean, her aim is going to suck. We know that. Okay. They're coming toward us. That's fine. We'll take them. We will take them on. Oh, Ridza can't see. Okay, well, I'm going to wait. I'll move her into that full cover spot after. So, I mean, I could try to put a bullet through his head, but a kill would be a lot better. Let's be honest. Uh, the other thing that arguably would be better still is this. I might even get a kill on one of them. Yeah, let's do it. Uh, do I want anybody on Overwatch? I actually don't think I do. Let's just do this. I'm honestly not positive that the grenade is the way to go here. Maybe I should have saved a grenade until they got behind cover and then blowed it up. I don't know. But we did kill one of them, so that's pretty good. And the other trooper is at death's door. I'm always a fan of that. Yeah, I have a better chance to hit and I won't use ammo. Let me think. Okay. Perfect. So, little rookie... Well, you can't kill it, but he could. Yeah, I'm going in. What's the loot? Give me the sweet, sweet loot. Uh, not that alien data caches aren't good, because they are. It's just the fact that uh, I have to use research time. And right now, that is kind of a thing for me. Vogue says I am to obey. Okay, that's as close as I'm going. I right see now. everything. Unlikely I'm that I'll right. need to be here, but just in case somebody comes along, I'll put her where her aim will be better. And First oh guys. man, I thought it was gonna happen. I seriously did. <laughs> I thought they were coming for me. Okay, so do I want to come that far forward? That could be a little reckless. I'm just going to peek around the corner. The patrol is yep. Coming. Uh, okay, so I could have done this, but I would have totally been setting him up to be revealed. I feel very good about the fact that I did not move that far forward. But I have another issue, which is that they could end up seeing me very easily here. Let me think about this. Obviously, I don't want to do it this turn. I definitely do not. I wonder if it would even be possible to pull them out. If I moved art over here somewhere and I had him use the claymore, I mean, I don't know if they're going to stand still, but let's do this. I'm going to pull him back out 
and I'm going to bring him over here. Yeah, hang on. Position I want to take a route that's as far from them as possible. <laughs> here, this is perfect. I can see all three of them. Understood. Moving out. I don't have high cover, but that, or I'm not in an elevated position, rather. But that's okay. Now, for him, I'm going to, again, I want to take a route that keeps me from being seen. Okay. And what about you? Again, I, I just want to be really careful. Not sure I can get... Get full cover for him. I'm on the move. I think I'll just come here. Okay. Okay, so I don't know if I'm being clear, but I'm going to do this next turn. If they go on patrol, then it's harder. But they didn't move. Okay. So, here's the plan. Uh, okay. Oh my god, it's two Lancers, no less. So I have to move forward with him, or I can't get it to the Lancers. And I don't think just the one... Yeah, no. I need to be at least two tiles closer. So coming here is not going to do it. I have to come here. I really don't like that. Oh, no. This would be good. Okay. I'll come here. It's full cover. So Claymore... It's a shame I can't hit the officer too, but they are not standing close enough together. So, here's where things get interesting. Because they're still not going to be able to see us when this blows. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. And they're like, hey, that wasn't nice. And they're kind of right. You know, they're definitely not wrong. I mean, we have more grenades. I'm wondering if this is the time. That looks like a pretty decent grenade to me. Grenade. It really, really does. Bye bye. Target's cleared. Now, um, I don't even know if I need to soften this guy up. Yeah, I probably do. So before I get cute, let's just take a shot here. I can use a shotgun if I need to. Okay, I don't need to. We're done. Works for me. Kill confirmed. All right, I feel pretty good about this. Okay, yeah, we're on a new turn. I just wanted to make sure. Uh, so, let me get Stealth Man and move I forward. Know what you tell me. I know there's another pod in here, right? We Well, I don't know for an absolute fact, but okay. I certainly believe it to be true. Don't think he's going to do me any more good back here. Even though I would love to keep him behind full cover and kind of tucked away and all that. Good to go. So, we're looking okay so far. I don't really know. Um, I don't think I've seen one of these missions. So, oh, I don't want to move forward with Danko. I think I'm going to leave him right where he is. And um, I'll move him up just a tiny bit. Move. That's fine. And again, like, I think there's no aliens on the map right now. 
Is that going to reveal him? It might. Moving to designated position. I'm a little anxious about that, so I'm not going to do it. Stepping off. I hate to waste time, but I think I'm going to... Um... Wait. Ooh. Okay. Got it. I like that. I didn't even see this. I feel like this is going to matter, though. Where's uh, Art? Did I already dash? Yeah. That's too bad. Rolling. So, I'm going to I'm going to have these two side by side. And for Danko. Hmm. See, I really want Art up here. Maybe I'll move Danko here. All right, I'll do that. Reposition. Somebody's going to come. As soon as we get her, something's going to happen. I mean, that's the most predictable thing ever. Okay. Um, well, I think we just have to do it. On target location. Is it a faceless? What's So, do we have two reinforcements? Yes. It's an ambush. Hold your ground. Mm-hmm. Well, I wish I'd have gotten art up top, but I didn't. So, you are going to go on Overwatch. Well, you're going to reload first. And Riggs, you are going to come right here. And you're going to go on a watch. Now you. Uh, hold on. Where is it? You're going to come here. Actually, well, no, it doesn't really matter. I'll come here and I'll hunker down. I don't know how much safer I can keep her. I mean, I think I'd rather concentrate my fire Moving and out. try and get some kills. I'll watch closely. So I think I'll do the same thing. I'll, oh no, I can't move him. Okay, just Overwatch. <sighs> He's not going to be good here. I'm going to move him up. He won't get Overwatch, but I might actually do some good once the fight starts. Yeah, see, he'll get Overwatch. He's fine. So what kind of reinforcements are we looking at? A Sectoid and a Trooper? Okay, that's not as bad. I was envisioning like an officer, a lancer, and a trooper on each side, which would have been kind of horrifying. Wow. Well, my plan to have rigs at point-blank range didn't turn out well because they gave the movement to the other side. That was very sweet, I think. Wait, there's more coming? Oh, brother. Okay, that feels a little cheap, I'm not going to lie. Well, that's the only guy I can see. And I have a 55% chance and no opportunity to kill him, really. And that's the only guy she can see. But, what if I did this? I feel like, you know, this is the way to go. Unless I use it on this knucklehead, but I can't. Unless I open the, the door. Okay. I'm going to use my grenade. One thing at a time. I got to do this for three turns, apparently. So we can at least get rid of some high cover. And now Art will actually have a good shot. Right? Where is Art? There he is. 95% qualifies. So let's take it. 
Okay, that's him done. Enemy down. Now, we still have the trooper. And then this trooper and this sectoid. I mean, I'm not killing everybody this turn. I think that's pretty obvious. He has a pretty good chance on this guy. I feel like having him kill the trooper is the way to go. If at all possible. That guy is in a pretty dangerous place for us. And Murtaugh... Okay, I thought he got it promoted, but he just got an ability point. Which is also very good. Okay, so these are the only two I have left. And what I had been thinking is that they would team up to take on the Sectoid. That feels like a mistake, because this guy um, is trouble. He is definitely going to attack. The Sectoid probably won't. So I think I come here, I have a guaranteed kill. Yeah. Sectoid will probably spend his turn raising the trooper or using a psionic attack. And then we'll try to kill him next turn. In the meantime, to help facilitate that, I'll soften him up. And soften him up a lot, but it's enough that Riggs could definitely kill him with his sword. Unfortunately, yeah, more dudes. Them being troopers helps in a way, because at least if we get hits, you know, I only need one hit from most of my guys to kill them. But this is definitely a challenge. We have one sectoid and four troopers alive right now. Oh, he did go for the attack. They don't often, but when they have a chance to flank, that's definitely when they're most likely to. Okay, well, listen, I'm going to come here, although that does leave me vulnerable to getting flanked, so let me think about that. Um, he has a pretty good shot at that guy, so I'm inclined to take it. Just take, you know, one dude off the board. Good. So we're down to three troopers. You know what? She has a decent chance here. And... Oh, ho, 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 baby. It's really important to remember that your feet are not nailed to the floor. So now we have a very good chance to kill. And we got it. And she's a squatty. A rookie no more. Okay, I need to be careful. Uh, this is the only guy left over there. Hmm. You know, interesting question. Should I kill the sectoid or the trooper? Because I could do either with my sword. You chill. Hmm. Yeah, I think I try for this at least oh i hate that weapon i really do the three minimum is just a killer oh well okay let me think about this giving rigs an extra action would not matter it would not um because if I came over here and killed the one guy, it doesn't really help. I can't flank unless I come here. But I leave him vulnerable to getting flanked. But this guy is not in... Well, see, he would be in a great position to attack Murtaugh. What if I came here? Would I still get the flank? Yes, I would. Okay. I'll do it. On my way. I'll do it. I'm far, so I don't have a great chance to hit. But it was good enough. Enemy eliminated. Okay, so now no we're in good shape here. Uh, you know what? I'm even going to reload first. Ready to engage. 
So there's one trooper left alive, and he doesn't really have good positioning against anybody. Advent forces on the ground. Yeah. Obviously, we can't keep doing this. They're moving to flank me. Okay. I'm probably just going to have to dash with him. They bring more for our hunt. Mm hmm. Yeah, he's out of ammo too. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to use teamwork on him. So her best shot is on that guy. I won't have a flank no matter where I go. Can he get close enough to anybody? Doesn't look like it. I could come here. Hold you that. At least start getting, you know. Okay. You just hunker down again. Uh, oh, I see. I'm going to have to move. Going to have to move somewhere. I could come here and I would flank the one dude. No guarantee I'd kill him, of course. But he's definitely problematic. Okay. I reload. Yeah. I don't think I can afford to stay here no matter what. Unfortunately, well, I would have to kill these two. That would be the key. So I tell you what. Oh, man. He is out of ammo. I can give teamwork to her. What if I... Hold on. What if I use a grenade here? Can I... I could come here. Right, I'm going to try this. I'm going to try this. We're going to try and get a little creative. Now, I could possibly just, you know, do that. There's even a very small chance for a kill. But let's do this. Frag out. Okay. So they're both like little china teacups now. And I'm going to reload her. All right. You're done. Now, Danko. You're going to come here. And you're going to kill him. Done. Remember, they are not weak. So see now I don't have to run with him. I can just take the flanking shot. And if I miss, I would even be able to have Riggs use teamwork to give him another shot. So that was pretty sweet. And here comes some more guys. But this is the first time I don't feel like we're totally on the back foot. Oh, I wish he'd have hit that, though. Because that would have really put us on top. That's all right. And here come two more. I just hope it's only troopers. I don't know. That's all? Everyone's in position for the extraction. Okay, so are you saying we can just call it down now? Place an evac. Okay, I'm very confused. Um, extract all XCOM operatives. Yeah, where am I supposed to do that? I, I don't get it. There's no extraction zone labeled. <laughs> what is he talking about? I, I don't get it. Yeah, I literally don't understand. That's not great. 
I don't put it up here, right? Yeah, no, it, it won't let me do it. And yet the evac thing is there. Where am I supposed to extract to? Do I just go out the back? Is, is this it? I don't get it. I am so confused right now. Okay, well, here. Um, let me bring rigs over here. Oh my god. Is the, is the game crashed? Well, welcome back. Uh, my game crashed when I tried to come here and attack him with my sword. And uh, so I have rebooted and it looks like we now have an extraction point. So that is definitely a plus. I think what I want to do is use that for her. I don't see any point keeping her in harm's way any longer than we have to. Okay. So now, here's the question. Um, I don't think Danko, yeah, he's not close enough. And Ridzik is, obviously she would be, Riggs is not. So where would I go with Riggs? I could come here and kill this guy, but I'd have to worry about him. And I mean, ugh. I can't, I can't go much. Three. I need three tiles and that's only two. I was thinking I could move here and shoot that guy and then use the others to kill him. He only has his pistol. Um, I, oh my gosh, this is brutal. Um, The only one who could potentially help here is her. But I re the problem is I really need to kill this guy. How do I do that with somebody besides Riggs? Because I could bring Riggs here, but that guy could easily Okay, hold on. I, I think I'm looking at this wrong. I'm going to bring her here. Position confirmed. And I'm going to try to shoot this guy. She has a decent chance at him, but I think this is the better play. Okay, okay. Enemy destroyed. So now... Um... You know, it would be funny. I'm going to try. Well, I'm going to see. <laughs> yeah. If this doesn't work, I'll have Murtaugh use teamwork. All right. I'll use teamwork and move him. Or take another shot. <laughs> Let me see. Could you do it? One. No. No. Yeah. One. Reload. Mm. I'm being stupid. Oh, you can't go that way. Okay, why don't you come up here? I think instead of trying to get cute and kill like every single guy that there is. It just makes more sense to uh, try and be safe. Actually, now that I think about it, I could have gotten him out. Oh, no, because he wouldn't have had enough movement to get out if I'd used teamwork that way. All right, we're out next turn. So basically, that guy is going to get to shoot at some people behind full cover. I just have to hope he misses. So... Jeez, did they just drop four dudes? They sure did. 
Oh, you're kidding me. He went on Overwatch. Let's get moving before that changes. Wow. Well, I'm getting him out. Um, yeah, I don't see any point in firing with the pistol. But I guess I can. Uh, I guess I risk her. I'm, I'm trying to think. Like, nobody has a grenade except Riggs. And I already use teamwork. So I can't really, you know, hit him with a grenade and then get out. Yeah, I mean, if a rookie ends up in a hospital, it's not the end of the world. Hopefully she doesn't end up dead. Okay, that's the best case, obviously. That sucked, man. She's done good work on this mission. I was not really looking to hang her out to dry. So, I'm glad she's okay. We'll get everybody on the pad. We'll evac all. And get out of here. Wow. And I come operatives are secure. Firebrand is returning to base. Excellent work out there. Whoo, zero wounded. I feel a little lucky, I'm not gonna lie. Hmm. Oh man. Yeah, that was tense. That was a tense mission. Hmm. Squad made it back whole and the aliens paid the price. Great work, Commander. Everybody but Danko got promoted, which is nice. Um Yeah, a couple of them may be tired after this, but Okay, Ridzik, welcome to being a corporal. Rook, what are you now? A specialist. Perfect. God, that's awesome. That was the next thing I wanted to train for, so we're good. I'm going to take Shadow Step. Um, like I said, when our last guy got promoted, uh, this a stupid assassin going on Overwatch all the time is a real killer, potentially. I so don't like either of these. Um, I'll take suppression. Wow. You know, it just occurred to me that on lost missions, demolition might be better. We definitely need to rest these two. His will was pretty low. A glorious battle. Advent stands no chance against our combined might, Commander. Okay. What do I want to do with her, actually? Um, I don't need to put her on the resistance ring. It's almost done. I, um, I'm fine with resistance comms. So I'm actually thinking maybe we go ahead. From what I've heard, the resistance has already seen a boost in their recruitment efforts after word of the commander's arrival got around. They've needed a leader just as much as we have. And now they'll be expecting us to hit the aliens where it hurts. Not that I'm worried. We've got plenty of people itching to take on Advent. Things are just starting to get interesting. So you can't, what I was looking at is, you can't have two people on one of these. I hope that's not true down here. It'll take literally forever. Yep, I'm going to go there. Ooh, I'm probably going to do that too. Uh, but I want my supply drop. We are not all that dissimilar, Commander. Mm -hmm. We have both lost and in turn caused great loss for others. Mm -hmm. I shed blood in my master's name. Just as you send others to shed Yay. blood in yours. 
Okay. Commander, have the factions system. you have contacted are well equipped to track down the Chosen. Their knowledge will be invaluable in helping XCOM locate and eliminate these threats. So that's the first building we have that would benefit from having an engineer staffed at it. And I really like the idea. We already have a covert operation yeah, okay. underway, Commander. So, but Take now we aren't limited to just one a month. So that's nice, at least. All right, cool. Well, we're slowly working our way, you know, out of just the infancy of this campaign. They give you so many missions in the early game now. Uh, it makes the progress way slower. Okay, so let's see. I think we come here. Avenger plotting new course. How am I doing? Yeah, my supplies are actually pretty decent. By the way, where am I on my research for magnetic weapons? Getting close, getting close. And the supply drop is 18 days. I think after this... Oh, heck. Yeah, yeah. So there go my data pads. Chosen aren't afraid to resort to sabotage tactics if it means slowing down our efforts. We need to work to prevent these attacks before they catch up with us. Commander, we've just received intel that one of Dr. Volan's escape test subjects is guarding a nearby Advent facility. Best be prepared before we try to take it out. Okay, so I think what I need to do is make contact here. Because we got to start working our way to that facility. That's really what it comes down to. And I need to make contact with somebody so we can keep building up our income base. Oh, you know what I was thinking? Oh, man, now I have to backtrack if I do it. Uh, but there was an engineer here. Maybe uh, maybe I spend the, uh, the, the intel now. Commander will need to completely scan this region before I think we I will contact with the local resistance we could I shorten we the uh, the length the of time the for the uh, what do you call it covert actions it'd be nice to feel like maybe we're getting just a tiny bit ahead I'm gonna do it okay God, I hope I don't regret that. <laughs> okay, uh, so let's put her to work. Yeah, so um, I could start clearing here. I think we do this. I think that makes sense. At least for now. I may switch off later, but... Yeah, uh, yeah, so that definitely cut that. Cut it in half, baby. Okay, back to making contact. Eight days. I doubt we'll get to finish it, but who knows. I wish I could get more intel, but I trust we will. Attempting to establish local regional contact. Okay, so I can train somebody else. Another rookie. Uh, who do we need? I mean, honestly, even though I just got a specialist, I could probably use another one. I've got one, two, three rangers. I've got two specialists. I could have swore I had three. Yes, I have three. Grenadiers, I have four. Sharpshooters, I have three. I'm pretty good with three sharpshooters. I don't feel like I need more than that. So the question is, yeah, you know what? I'll take another specialist. That's what I'll do. Because the reality is that there's times where you just really need to send a specialist on a mission. And if they're both tired or hurt or tied up for some reason, it's really going to suck. 
So, specialist it is. And then, I don't know, I may want to keep the rest of the rookies as rookies until I figure out what else I would want. But, Commander, as I figured, we have to stop now. We're getting requests for support from multiple sites around the world. Unfortunately, we only have the resources to respond to one of them. The decision is yours. Hmm. I kind of like this one, to be honest. Um... <laughs> Okay, with the name Operation Demon Stank. That's pretty juicy all by itself. Bone Blade isn't bad either, but I don't think you can compete with Demon Stank. Um, we don't really need supplies right now. Like we're, I mean, we, you can always use supplies, but we're pretty okay right now. Uh, but getting another scientist, we haven't had one in quite a while. And we have a lot of stuff we're gonna have to research. So when we come back, we'll try to counter the hidden event and get a scientist. That's all for now. Thanks for watching. I hope we see you next time.